Hey YouTubers, I'm back. Thank you again for tuning in to Guitar Funk Player. By request today, what I have for you is Minnie Ripperton's Loving You. This is an old school soul classic. You're going to love it. The chords are actually pretty simple, so I'm going to break down the two sections of the song. And do me a favor, drop me a comment in the comment section for any songs that you want me to do. I've been getting to all these requests, and so more and more are coming in. But also, if you feel free, you want to give, uh, go to my Patreon link in the description section and you can give there. Thank you so much and don't forget to subscribe to Guitar Fun Play. Loving you. So I want to try this uh, so you can see my fingers here. A lot of my subscribers have mentioned that, you know, since my fingers are big, it's hard to see the chords. So I wanted to break this down for you. Um, the chords to this song, basically you're going to start here in D major seven. So D major seven's in the fifth fret. So you're barring everything like this. You're taking your finger here, your middle finger, and you're putting it right here on the sixth string on the G string. Then you're taking this finger, your ring finger, and putting that on the D string in the seventh fret, and then your pinky on the B. That's a D major seventh, and that's what it looks like. Okay? So it has this like, kind of like that. If you want to play it just like, you know, the record, it's like, Okay, like that, or you could just strum it. So it's D major seven. Then you're gonna go here to this next chord, you're gonna go up one fret to a C, uh, or a, you could call it a D flat minor seventh, like that, or a C sharp minor seven. Okay, so that's cut barring everything in the fourth fret, putting your middle finger in the fifth fret on the B string, and then putting this finger on the D string in the 6th fret. Now we're going to take the same shape, just leave it just like that, slide it up 2 frets to a B minor 7th. Okay, and then you're going to go to this A major 7th. Now A major 7th's here, but you can play it here too. So it's like this. So all that is, is you're going to take your ring finger and put it on the B string in the 2nd fret, your, your middle finger on the D string in the 2nd fret, and then, your, uh, and then this finger here, your uh, pointer finger, on the, on the G string in the 1st fret. So like that. Pretty chord, right? You can play it here too. Right? So it's like... You. It's easy cause you're beautiful. <laughs> Can't sing that song really, but you know... That's when you hit the A. Okay, just a regular A. And when she goes up with her voice, right? A. Like that. Okay, so that's the intro. There's only two parts to this song. The second part, I'm going to break it down for you. It's pretty simple. 
I mean, you're basically using the same chords you've been, we've been using. So you're hearing this B7. Same chords you know, the B minor 7th to C sharp minor 7th. Same things we've been doing. Right? So it's B minor 7th to C. The yeah, C uh, sharp minor 7th to B7. A major 7th. And then it'll go... Now we're going to hit like... All right. Wait. Then D to E, like that. So let's try that again. Now we're going to play a D bar chord. Or you could play a D. Or a D if you want to, E like that, but just play this. Cover all four, five, six strings. Then cover these three or four. And then slide it down to the seventh fret to E. And then back to. So as you can see, that is a for a high-pitched singer, someone who has that range. But that's a great song. This is an awesome song. You'll see it everywhere. Awesome soul classic. So do me a favor. Drop that comment. Let me know if there's any songs you want me to do. And uh, keep them coming. God bless. Have a great day.